What's up, YouTube? This your boy, B-Boy Facts on TV, and tonight I'm going to give you guys my AEW Rampage review on highlights. So you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell. Um, every time I premiere a brand new video and, and I go live, um, follow my social media, my Twitter, my Instagram, my TikTok, and Twitch, and Discord down below in the description. Let's talk about AEW Rampage tonight. So there are 24 match cards on the show. But anyway, we're kicking things off with Sammy Guerrero versus Darby Allen versus Adrade El Don versus Adrade, a triple threat match with an AEW TNT Championship. Now this match was good. I enjoyed this match. So it says Darby and Sammy are on the are on one side and asks Adrade to take them on. Adrade slips to the floor and does not want both at the same time. They go to the floor and Adrade has has to come back to the ring. Sammy and Darby work in tan tandem for a quick offense on Andrade. That that last that lasts until Sammy Guerrero break Darby Allen's pin attempt on Andrade. Sammy and Darby go at it and Sammy hits a drop kick. He hits chops in the corner. Darby Allen stops stops a suplex but Sammy Guerrero hits running knee while he was Still on the top. Sammy hits an integrate and goes for a super flex again. Adrana joins the joins them to the joins them to make it a three a trio wolf spot. All three are down. Adrana goes goes to pin Sammy, but he kicks out. Adrana drops Darby on the rope. He slams his belt on Darby's back to Darby's back to take us to the break. Um, back from the break, Andrade has beaten, uh, beaten of uh, both opponents during the break. Andrade hit the three amigos on Sammy, sending him into the turnbuckles with the last suplex. Um, Darby Allen hits him with a couple of punches before Andrade hits him with urine, 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 urine. Andrade goes for the moonsault from the top. Darby... Allen moves away, but Andrade follows up to connect on Sammy for a near fall. Andrade hits Meteora. Yeah, Andrade hits Meteora on Darby Allen. Um, um, Andrade trade strikes with Darby Allen and Sammy on the other side. Sammy hits a super kick on Andrade while he was looking for a German suplex. Um, Darby Allen sends Sammy to the floor. Andrade counters. Connor's coffin splash with knees. Andrade hits a body slam. He goes to the top, but Darby trips him. Um, Darby slams Andrade with his belt. Sammy hits coast to coast drop kick on Andrade while he was in a tree of wolf. Darby hits a suicide dive on Andrade. Sammy, Sammy waits for Darby to get back to the ring and puts him in the cradle for a two count. They trade more pin attempts. Andrade hits a big boot on Darby and lifts Sammy to hit one handle handed power bomb. Darby Allen breaks the pin. Andrade hits a back elbow on Darby. Um, Darby Allen hits a stunner on Andrade and Sammy hits him with GTH. Darby throws Sammy out of the ring and he hits Andrade with a coffee drop. Sammy returns to Turns to break the pin and then pins Andrade for himself. The winner of the match and still your TNT champion, Sammy Guerrero. This was this was a good match. I, I enjoyed it. This was a good match. Alright, let's move on. Alex brings up how Melkai Black says House always wins, but House only but House only wins wins deception. He 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 says while they are one man down. There are three of them to face three or four from House of Black on Revolution. House of Black appear on the screen for a promo before the lights goes out. House of Black are on the apron when they when the lights come back. They were looking to get they were looking to get into the ring when Alex stops them and says their third member is not in the ring. They bring out Eric Redbeard. Eric Redbeard gets in the ring and a bunch of security guards enter the ring immediately to, to stop any confrontation. 
Eric Redbeard runs through the security to attack House of Black. House of Black leaves leaves the ring. Death Triangle and Eric Redbeard beat up security for a while. Um, Dan Lambert is backstage with Scorpio Sky and and talks about art of neg negotiation. He reveals that he has negotiated and TNT title match for Scorpion with Scorpio Sky against Sammy Guerrero next week on Dynamite. In return, he will bring Paige Vanzant Van to sign an AEW contract. All right, so we get Keith Lee versus um, JD Drake. This is a quick match. JD Drake hits some punches, but Keith Lee no sells them. Lee hits Drake with double chops. Keith Lee char charges at him in the corner, but Drake, but JD Drake jumps over him. J JD jumps on him. Keith Lee runs the ropes and stands JD Drake flying with a big tackle. Uh, we cut to a we cut to a break. JD Drake hits a knee and a lariat on Lee Keith Lee. Keith Lee hits back hits back with a headbutt. J.D. Drake avoids a charge in the corner and hits a drop kick. He hits a cannonball in the corner. He goes to the top and hits a moonsault, but Keith Lee breaks the pin by, by sending him flying. Keith Lee puts J.D. Drake on top. Well, on the top. J.D. Drake goes for a crossbody, but Keith Lee catches him. Keith Lee lifts J.D. Drake up and hits his Big Bang Theory to get the pin. The winner of the match, Keith Lee. After the match, the wingman attacked Keith Lee and beats them up. Brian Nem Nemes is hit with powerbomb. Keith Lee picks up Peter Alvin and throws him over the ropes and onto the other members of the wingman. Ricky starts and Powerhouse Hall starts to approach Keith Lee, but Orange Cassidy comes out to the stage to show that he is with Keith Lee. We get a promo from CM Punk that he has done after MJF's brutal attack on Dynamite earlier this week. CM Punk says MJF is delusional to think he is a PG Punk now and will see the same Punk that he grew up watching. CM Punk says he will beat MJF and leave parts of his body all over Orlando at Revolution. CM Punk will become a monster to fight the monsters of the world. Because I am CM Punk, I am better than better than you. So we get Serena D versus Leah Lila Leela Gray. Quick match. Leela gets out of the ring to waste time. Serena D follows her to the floor and Leela gets back to the ring only to get out of the other side. Serena Deep catches her on the apron and starts beating up Leela. Serena Deep puts on a front headlock and gets the submission. The winner of the match, Serena Deep. All right. After the match, Serena Deep puts Leela, Leela, Leela in the certain lock. Hakari Shida makes her return and knocks Serena D with the candlestick shot. Serena D runs away into the crowd to avoid more attacks. So we get the main event of the evening. So yeah, we get the main event of the evening. Christian Cage versus Ethan Page face face of the revolution ladder match. Alright, Page push push Cage to the corner. Cage flicks flicks his finger. And flicks flicks his face to to enrage and invite Page punches. Cage hits a drop kick and throws Page to the floor. He hits a drop kick through the ropes and takes us to the break. Page has taken control of the match. During the match, Cage slams his face on the steel steps and hits a tornado DDT on the floor. Christian Cage Christian Cage hits hits punches from the second rope. Cage with a sunset sunset flip to get a two count. He is an Ember DT to get another two count. Page 
hits a cutter for a near fall. Cage ducks a clothesline and drops Cage on the ropes. Cage hits diving headbutt for another two count. Cage charged, but Page runs him over with a shoulder tackle for a two count. Cage avoids Eagle's edge and hits a spear for an, another near fall. Cage goes for goes for the kill switch, but Page counters to send him into the ring post. Cage counters Eagle's edge and hits the and his kill switch to get the pin. The winner of the match, Christian Cage. So we get Jurassic Express come out to celebrate with Chris and Cage. The Young Bucks and Red Dragon come out to the ramp and tease, and tease attacking them. Kyle Riley and Nick Jackson, Nick Jackson each pull out one tag title belt and celebrates. This brings some tensions between the two teams on the floor. Jungle Boy hits them with suicide dives to close the show. And AEW Rampage goes off the air. But let me know down below in the comment section what are your thoughts on AEW Rampage. Um, if you guys enjoy my AEW Rampage review on highlights, please give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what are your thoughts on AEW Rampage, which is what's a good, bad, decent. You guys let me know down below in the comment section. Um, subscribe to my channel if you are new. Uh, turn on notification bells so you guys can. So you guys, when I miss not a premiere video or when I go live, follow my social media, my Twitter, my Instagram, my TikTok, and Twitch, and Discord down below in the description. And I will see you guys tomorrow on Twitch for more for more to come at eleven. And that's all I got to say from there. But anyway, this is your boy B Boy Facts Johnny TV. Have a great night. Stay safe and always stay positive. And I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great weekend, and I'm out of here.